Howdy, it's RB and Leanne with AFK Days, and today... We've been keeping a secret for a little bit. We bought our little guy Max trailer back in early 2020. And it was a great first trailer for us. We learned a lot, had a lot of fun, saw in a lot of new places. But it did have some limitations that we didn't quite expect. We were looking for something that we could go off grid a little bit more, but sadly that was not the case. We realized that we were not able to have the types of trips we wanted. So I started looking around for a new trailer without really discussing it with Leanne. And when we took the little guy in to get some maintenance work, I noticed a trailer out on the lot that caught my attention that I'd seen some fairly interesting videos on. But when we went back to pick up the little guy from maintenance, I made Leanne go with me and she looked at the trailer. And her response was a lot more positive than I expected. Surprisingly, I liked it too. It is bigger, it's longer and taller, so I was pretty hesitant about that part because I'm quite content with our 21 foot little guy. We also went and looked at some Airstreams. And they were nice inside, they had lots of amenities, it was comfortable, I, they were just great. But again, we were worried they wouldn't quite suit the adventures that we were wanting to have and places we wanted to go. We wanted something more rugged, and we wanted something that could stay off grid for extended periods of time. So what do we get? We, we got, got a Black Series! got the Black Series HQ-19. Now they have a whole range of trailers, everything from small trailers to stuff bigger than this. This is probably the second largest in their lineup, but we felt this was the right size for us. It gave us the right capabilities. Off-road rugged, it's got uh, independent suspension, plus it's got an articulating hitch on the front that allows for going over rough terrain, which we tested out extensively in one of our recent trips. We've probably been in it uh, a couple of weeks already we've taken some trips we just got back from West Texas where we really put it through its paces if you'd like to see that video it's coming up the inside is fabulous and is very luxurious for a trailer that you can take almost anywhere it has a great queen-size bed a nice size kitchen on the inside my favorite part is the great outdoor kitchen no longer stuck to cooking inside and missing out on those great views it also has a large bathroom. We are upgrading from our previous wet bath, which is also very nice. We have a full shower and plenty of room in there. I really thought you were gonna say your favorite feature of the trailer was the bathroom. That kind of surprised me. Mm -hmm. That's a close second. The trailer is so nice. It feels like we're in a luxury hotel out in the middle of nowhere. It's like we're cheating. We feel a little guilty about that, but not really. <laughs> it makes staying in the trailer so much better. Right, and this was a great fit for us because we are able to go on rugged trails. Plus, the unique design does draw a lot of attention. All right, let's take you inside and give you a quick tour. Come on in. Welcome to our HQ-19. Give you a quick little tour. Here is our queen size bed. Lots of clothing storage above. We have our kitchen. Like I said, one of my favorite parts. Pretty good counter space. We have a general water faucet and a drinking water faucet that's filtered. So that's been a nice addition. Great cabinets. Very sturdy. We haven't had any fallout. Another one of my favorite features is we have soft closed drawers all throughout the trailer. We have a three burner stove, 
an oven, which is new for us. We've enjoyed that so far. And then a larger refrigerator and freezer. That's been nice that we're able to pack more food for longer trips and not have to worry about stopping at a store somewhere. We've got a nice sized dinette. This table is a lot less annoying than our old trailer, so we are loving that. This is our bathroom. Look at all this room. Real shower over there. We have this fancy sink. Feel like I'm at a spa sometimes. And it has a real door. One of our favorite things in our little guy trailer were the great windows. We are missing a few windows, but this trailer still has quite a few large windows and it is still the European style pop out. We like that with the privacy shade and the screen. There are lots of great amenities to this trailer, but one of the ones in the inside that stands out to me is this great skylight. Pull that, push up, and you can get to the roof. You can also bring it down and lock it in, and it too also has the window shade, and it has the screen. It's great to look at the stars when you're in bed. One of the nice features of the trailer is the control panel. It gives you an idea of how much power is being used, access to both water pumps, it has your drinking water, general water, black water, and gray water tank indicators. And they seem to be fairly accurate. This is the front of the trailer. You've got these two massive storage compartments, and this one is the diesel reservoir, and here we've got two propane tanks. Just love the way this looks. We also have our jack and our articulating hitch. It's taken us a little while to get used to how to hook and unhook the trailer, but we're getting better at it and it does give us a lot more capability for off-road travel. We hope you enjoyed that quick tour of our Black Series HQ19. Remember to stay tuned for an upcoming more detailed tour. If there's something you'd like us to feature or want to know more about, leave us a comment and let us know and just let us know what you think of our new trailer. We're really excited about the roads and campsites this trailer opens up for us. We have some more adventures and videos coming soon. See you in the next video.